Hello, this is Moneymaker. Today I'm going to talk about the data cruncher. Data cruncher is a uh, tool that is used for real estate to calculate average home prices online. And I've used it and made about a few thousand dollars, a few thousand to ten thousand dollars like per month on deals. I already sold like three or four properties. The creator of this software is Jerry Norton. Based on his uh, information on flipmastery.com. I'm going to show you the video. The video will talk about, usually in about three minutes, how to use it. First thing is uh, enter your zip code. And next is it brings you to the website. It gives you the proper listings. And it's all explained in the video. And I'll start it right now. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this to everyone so they know about the Dare Cruncher software. And let's start it out. Okay, this is Jerry Norton here. Welcome to the Data Cruncher tool to help you find underpriced on market properties. Now, there are a few steps that we have to follow. So very first thing you wanna do is put in your zip code right here. Click next step. And then it's gonna walk you through a couple of prompts here. So just follow this real carefully here. First thing you wanna do is click here to download your CSV files. So if you click on that, it's gonna open up Redfin right now and it's gonna have this data here. And then what you wanna do is you wanna scroll down here to where it says download all. See this button right here? Now you're gonna click that button and what it's gonna do is it's gonna open up and say, okay, well, where do you wanna save this on your computer? Now what I want you to do is I want you to do a couple things to keep your data organized. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna click new folder, call it data cruncher, click create. Then we're going to create another folder under that one called zip codes. And then under the zip codes, we're going to create this property that we're going to name 48371. And then I'm going to click save. Now what it did is it saved it under that file system on my computer. Then since this opened a new window, I'm going to go back over to the window where the software is. Then I'm going to click here where it wants to know to get that file. So I click choose file and then I'm gonna go click on that folder there and under zip codes and there's my file that I just downloaded. I'm gonna click open and then it's gonna it's gonna upload that into the system and I'm gonna click calculate and then it's gonna open up another window and it's gonna have all of my data. Now a couple things I want you to notice here very first is up here it says for this zip code the average price per square foot, sold price per square foot is 153. There are currently 38 active properties for sale right now under that, those are the ones that we wanna look at and go after, they're underpriced. And a couple things here, if I put my mouse over the address, you can see where it's bouncing on the left-hand side there, you see a pin bouncing on the map that lets you know where it's at. It also has the current price, bedrooms, bathrooms, square footage, price per square foot. And then this is kind of cool here, tells you how far below the average sold price per square foot that listing currently is for sale for. So this particular one here is 30% below uh, $153 a foot. Now I have a couple things I can do to look at that. I can click on the link button right here, or I can just click on the address. So if I go down here and I pick one of these, you can see here it pulls up this property. There it is right there on Lakeview Drive. That opened up another window. So to go back, I would just go back up here and then I'm back to my um, screenshot of the property. And if I wanted to go back to the tool, I could click this back button. It would let me go back to the search field. Um, don't click that unless you're done working on any leads that you're interested in here. Because if I click back, what it will do is it will take me back to the main screen where I would have to do that again. Okay, that's how, how you use the tool. Good luck. Happy hunting. I hope you find some awesome deals. If you like this video, hit the like button. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video to everyone so they know about it. Also, check out my other YouTube channel, Cyber Dragon, for some other money-making tips. That one will mostly face on affiliate marketing, surveys, and a bunch of other programs. This channel will mostly face on different variety of ways you can do in real estate and other types of businesses. In a business plan, all the tools will be mostly on this site. The other site is going to be separately. And I hope to see you guys again next time. Goodbye.